guys this is faces by dimples i bought two wigs for my birthday and i didn't know which one i was gonna go with i already did like a video on facebook but i didn't have a brush when i did that video when i went live on facebook so now i got a brush and i bought my uh my uh what is it called wand curler too to test it out even further to give you guys a little bit more detail than i did on facebook so let me just jump right in it let me see here so this is i bought two like i said and this red one is pretty bold for me um and it's pretty bright too this one is from shining star off of aliexpress shining star the shipping was pretty fast actually i thought it was gonna get here in like five days but it came like three days later i think two or three days later so it came both of them came sooner than i expected so i'll give them both that shining star this red one it is 26 inches body weight 13 by 6 lace 180 density um it is not pre-plucked um it does come with a band ooh, ooh. so let's give i'm gonna put this one back on i did my face because i'm like <laughs> I can't come on here without a face trying to try on wigs. I look crazy as enough. This, oh, this one did not come with any lashes. It did come with um, the wig caps. You know, your standard wig cap, and that's it. So if you're looking for a bunch of stuff, like a whole bunch of goodie bags from uh, <laughs> Shining Star, don't expect too much, but that's all right. You pay for a wig. Oh, let me put this on. I was trying to, like, tuck the lace in so y'all could, like, see how much... They give you a lot of lace on this one. Like, dang, I can, I'm gonna wear it like a, I can wear it like a hat almost. Like, <laughs> they give you, they are not playing. They give you a bunch of lace, but since it's, it's supposed to be like, yeah, I would probably, I would probably put it like right here. Oh my goodness! But I was just, I was testing myself to see how daring I was gonna be for my birthday this year. I'm gonna be 21 again, and I just wanted to like, let me try something different. Okay, I got a brush, oh my gosh. I was trying to do stuff with this on Facebook and I did not have a brush. It was like, Courtney, your little crocodile fingers are not gonna work. So, and then it's starting to grow on me. You know how you keep looking at it and like, eh, but then when you keep wearing it, like, eh, and then you're wearing it, like, eh, ain't that bad. So right now I'm in the, and stage but then when i look back at the video i'm like it's not bad but i am not i don't wear bright bold colors like this so i thought i was going to that's why i bought it like let me just let me just try it out you only live once right and you only gotta wear it once you ain't gotta wear it every day but okay so now let me see how it curls so my wine curler i saw a little smoke there it looked like it's ready so we're gonna see how it curls it feels nice so that's good and this color is like it's banging this color like as far as like not being faded out and stuff so let's see if it passed the curl test without frying on me i don't know i'm not feeling sexy red right now but i don't know we'll see i might Ooh. Oh, okay for the curl. All right, well, it passed the curl test, and it look at the difference when you curl it, like how it looks. Fuck, look, I'm all over here, but. <laughs> Look at the difference too from curling it in like it gave it back some shine that back here. Let me do this piece since I'm in the mood now. I got time today. That's what people be saying. I got time today. Try me. I got time today. Let me do this piece. Alright, so I'm gonna handy bandy one. I don't know. I might do the red. Y'all gotta let me know if y'all feel this red or not. I mean, essentially, I gotta feel the red, but, you know, sometimes people see stuff you don't. So, if you see that this red ain't it for me, just let me know. But, if I wanna be bold, I think I should go with the red. 
my original intentions is going blind and just dying. Oh my goodness. Look at that. And then if I, I might go red. I don't know. You know what? I might have some friends out there that just be like, girl, take both on your birthday trip. Just take both. Just take both wigs. One half of your trip be red and the other half be blind. And you know what? I might do that. But yeah. Okay, we'll see. As far as the quality, you know, the hair itself, I'm feeling it. And, you know, you come, of course you gotta cut the baby hairs and all that stuff. Do your part, flat iron it. But this is just out of the box. I got it, and I just wanted to show you guys how it was. So that's that. All right, shining star. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Let's put you back tuck you away until I decide what I'm gonna do with you. Let's get this little bag if they put it in. I don't mind it. And then I'll put you back in here. Nice and soft. Put you back in your little satin that you here too. Boom. Alright, next one is tuneful. I got a blonde, tuneful, lace front wig. It is 26 inches also, 13 by 6 lace. This one does not have a band like the Shining Star on it, but it is pre-plugged, unlike the Shining Star. But nonetheless, um, I'm not, that the plugging part and the band isn't too big. I'm not too picky on that because either way, I'm going to probably put pluck that one and these snaps usually work for my head and the clips usually work for me anyway that's why I like wearing the wig cap too because of the clips uh otherwise there are a lot of short pieces on here and when I did the Facebook thing I'm like I'm like it's flyaways but you only get flyaways if you got a bunch of short pieces and Tunefo did short me on some hair strands but nonetheless oh both of these are 180 density, if I didn't already say that. So let's see. So this is the blonde. So with this one, my intentions anyway is to dye the roots like a chocolate mocha color, but not a lot. What, what I'm gonna do is, okay, let me show y'all what I'm gonna do. This is my plan. I'm gonna do a video on me at once I dye it, I mean, me dyeing it. So what I wanna do I'm gonna keep this part, this color, then dye the roots a bit going this way, dye those roots, dye those roots right there. And then I kinda wanna, I'm gonna add some low lights in here just to give it some dimension so it's just not a straight 613 wig just plopped on my head. Um, I think that's it. Cause I don't, I really don't want to go ash blonde. I'm not trying to go, I don't want no like silver. And I do still want like that brightness, but I'm gonna add some low lights. Maybe like all uh, back here, maybe like a five nine. I want to keep the front bright and then add some roots in there too. And then probably bleach these knots as well. More than likely. They're like, you can't wear 613 if you don't bleach the, the knots. But otherwise, hopefully that's going to be the real test to this 613 is how good it takes to the color. So right now, just popped on my head. I can't really give it a good review until I dye it and hopefully it dyes well. The ends, you guys might want to look at the ends too. How are these ends looking? It gets cut anyway. Some of the stuff that y'all be wanting to see, like y'all going to manipulate and change it anyway. So... The important part is, is it going to dye well? Is it going to last? How is it going to look after I, I color it and wash it, blow dry it out and flat iron? Oh, you know what? I could, guess I could do the curling test on this one. Might as well see if it curls. Let's see if it curls before I do any of that to it. Hopefully it still curls after as well. Might as well use these, this curling rod since I got it out. Mm -mm -mm. 
If you want to see me die this, follow this channel. <laughs> I'm already old. Y'all don't believe I'm about to be 21. Because I'm like, I said follow this channel. What does it say? Subscribe. It didn't curl. Oh my goodness. It's, it's not passing the curl check. Oh lord, I'm doomed. Hold on, wait. May day. May day. Y'all Alright, let's give it the benefit of the doubt because I think I turned off my but uh my wine curl. So we're gonna give it the, the benefit of the doubt. We're gonna try this again. See if it curls. Look at these little you see all these like short pieces just sticking out. Like, hey, I know you see me. Look at that. So tuneful, that that's not cool. Look, do you see all them little Look at that. All these little short pieces in here. So maybe I should get a 613 in the shining star next time I order off of AliExpress. All right, let's try it again. It should be warmed up. We'll give you a second go around, see if you curl this time. Okay, all right. I was about to say, like, tuneful. You really not letting your hair curl out here? Is that stubborn? Okay, it curls. I was about to say, like, okay, so that's my bad. I, <laughs> me trying to be responsible and turning off hot, hot appliances. Hot appliances. Hot appliances. I forgot to turn it back on when I did. I forgot to, uh, I accidentally turned it off. We used to like, okay, you done with it, done, done with it, turn it off. Let me do one more strand and see. It's curling, so that's good. I'm going to leave the link for these below so you can know what to get or what not to get in the case of this 613. But I think it's going to curl fine. I seen, I, I got it because of the reviews. There, the pictures in the reviews show that it curls, I mean, it colors fine. Look at all those, like short pieces that's kind of annoying it's kind of annoying but not as annoying as returning it because you don't want it because it ain't what you thought it was going to be all right let's see oh this can't wait to say yeah that needs to get laid down it's all in the way but all right it does curl so that's a good sign we're gonna try to work with it wish me the best as i dye it and manipulate it and give it some more body so it's not just flat all right well that was my review follow so you can see what I do next to this hair when I 